Hi there everyone, this is Jay Harris coming to you from Tom's Trading Room. I'm going to cover a couple of things in this video presentation. The first thing is how to use the search function in the forms. And the reason I'm going to show you that is because we've had a handful of requests asking for information and education on how to post images into the discussion boards and forms. There is some dialogue in the forums that has already taken place on the subject matter. So if I can show you how to use the keyword search function, you can actually go and find the topic on how to post images and then learn how to do that for yourself. So let's get started. If you're logged into the tools already, that's fine. If not, you can get into the forms by clicking on the form tab. Go ahead and log in. And once you get logged in, just simply recognize that across the top of this light blue nav bar, you have the tab that says search. Click on search and then scroll on down a little bit and you'll see all that you can do. You enter in your search criteria right here. The keyword search I'm going to type in is image. I would suggest you do the same. You can search by author, you can search in specific forms, and then you have additional sorting criteria down below. Just leave it typed in image, click submit, and I'll show you what the results kick back. It says index search topics with posts containing the word image. The ones I want you to click on and read are creating an avatar. This is done by one of our primary and chief beta testers who works hand in hand with our program, which is Kevin. If you click on there, you will get to the discussion where he teaches you how to create the little avatar attached to your name. Hit backspace. That way you don't have to do a new search and it takes you to the list that was already created for you. Showing risk graphics in the form is another one that I want you to go to. This was done by our programmers. It gives some information and education on how to go through the steps to get this risk graph or images posted into the forms. Let's go back one more time. And then how to post a chart was done by Sister Pat, one of our partners, who is a chief hand-in-hand -hand assistant, if you will, during the Butterfly Mastery Series for Christina Nugent. So she has in there how to post charts or how she does it. Now there are a number of different uh, places on the internet that can help you with this type of stuff, such as PhotoBucket or Gyazo or others. But Pat, you see, is using PhotoBucket. Here's Kevin also putting in his two cents as to how you can post in the forums and some education that is available at the bottom of the posts in your forum screens. Let me go back. So again, folks, that's a quick uh, little video on how to use the keyword search functions for the forums. As well, when you type an image, you're going to get some education on how to post your images into the forums. And that way you can go ahead and have some visuals to accompany your questions and the dialogue that you guys create on these threads. There's been a lot of great uh, conversations, communications, and collaborations going on on the discussion boards. We want to encourage that, and hopefully this will help you guys raise your game and use it with more effectiveness and as for now, that wraps it for me. Thanks, folks. See you soon.